And we're still struggling with the things these theories have taught us about our world, the universe, and reality. So, let's rewrite general relativity. I would like to propose a different way of thinking about dimensions and space itself. I believe the reason we have gone for over a hundred years since Einstein without being able to understand where this extra dimension is comes down to one image that has been pounded into our brains ever since this started. All the ways we experience time are what we actually call in science as an emergent property. We live our entire lives in only one frame of reference. Time has become a kind of conceptual spaghetti. Even C is not constant in all frames of reference in general relativity. If there is five dimensions, where is it? Great question. This equation is also practically useless. It's oversimplified. Instead of a bowling ball on a trampoline, a more accurate analogy would be a bowling ball in jello is not because you are being pulled down to the Earth. It's because the Earth is accelerating up towards you. We just need to adjust our awareness and examine our assumptions of what a dimension should be. We already know what a tesseract looks like. It actually looks like this. Perspective is not the same as reality. But we never seem to apply that common sense when it comes to things like black holes. Something I've just never seen anyone really talk about is why. We can explain quantum mechanics through general relativity. We're never going to understand uh, extra dimensions by taking our three-dimensional graphs and just sticking more arrows onto it. It is important for us to discern what is physical, what is measurable, and what we're actually observing, and be careful not to bring all of our previous assumptions into it. So, what's inside a black hole?